Hey guys, it's Luke here and welcome back to another video. You join me today with another M140 i At first glance, you probably think it's a stock M140 i but believe me, it is far from that. This is a stage three car. It's running the Osprey Performance OP1000 kit, not currently running 1000 horsepower, but probably will be somewhat down the line. Um, it's owned by my friend Sean from the channel SA3 TV. Links are all down in the description. This thing is an absolute sleeper. I filmed some sleeper spec cars in the past, but this genuinely is a proper sleeper. I'm talking stock kidney grills, no splitter, uh, even like a stock, OEM kind of reg plate, you know, stock wheels, stock suspension, everything, and even an open diff. But it is an absolute machine, and I'm really, really looking forward to experiencing this because obviously I have my own M140i running uh, stage three, you will know that, but I very rarely spent any time in the passenger seat of one of these things, especially when they're making big power. So we'll introduce you to Sean, have a walk around the car before we head on out in this stage three sleeper spec M140i. Okay, Sean, mate, welcome back to the channel. It's been a while, actually. Sean's been on the yeah. channel before with the old S3. You guys may remember that, probably nearly two years ago now that, that was. Yeah, about, about two years ago, about yeah. About that. Well, now we've got the uh, new beast. M140i. This is a, a bit of a weapon, isn't it? Yeah. At, at first glance, it's a stock car. Well, that's kind of, I mean, that's kind of the whole point. I wasn't yeah. really kind of looking towards the whole fully modified and it saves me the headache of being pulled out of my cops every five minutes, <laughs> so it's not worth it, except the diffuser. Yeah, that's but, true. Yeah, that's literally the only visual yeah, pretty much. Thing. I mean, the only thing you could probably see, obviously, you've got the front man intake. Very true. Yeah. yeah but that's that probably the there. only give. I'd say that's the second giveaway. Yeah. The first yeah. giveaway is the diffuser with the F1 light. Yeah. Exactly. Other than that, that's really it. But uh, after the S3, so yeah, I had a couple of cars after that. But now we've got an M140i, uh, which unfortunately has upset a couple of people. So. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at this thing. Yeah. Under here, it is. Stunning. Yeah. So I'll, I'll take you guys just a little short, uh, short brief of what's yeah, kind of happened. So as you guys know, it's running open diff, stock suspensions, the whole lot, uh, except obviously what's happening here. The reason being is because I wasn't kind of planning on getting the OP1000 kit. My wife was the one that actually gassed me up to actually <laughs> go for it. Love that. Uh, it's funny because it's true, she was. And um, so I kind of had no time to kind of get LSD, yeah. Dorch high pressure fuel pump. And I had none of that time because yeah, this yeah. kit came out so quick. Yeah, you, I mean, there's very few out there with this kit, right? 100%, yeah, I think there's only two at the moment. So okay. me and Harvey, yeah. but he's running literally well, well, a lot more power yeah, than that's, I Yeah, that's a beast actually. So I'll take you through, you'll see you've got an upright charge pipe done by Osprey Performance. I mean, I really like the whole Osprey logo. It's quite cool, cool actually, mm. yeah. Then you've got, it's got a TU pump. Okay. Um, it's got upright water lines. It's got, a, as you can see, the Turbo Smart wastegate there. Mm -hmm. And if you can see that pipe, that's the screamer pipe. Which, okay, yeah, yeah, which yeah. completely transforms the sound of the car. It does not sound like a B58 anymore. No M140 yeah, with a screamer pipe. But even on my videos, if you check my channel out, all you see the videos, you hear it, it does not sound like a B58 anymore. No it's way. insane. Obviously, you've got the upright manifold that was yes. made by Chris okay. at Osprey Performance, but it was coated by Imico. Okay, yeah. Uh, other than that, that's pretty much it. You've Obviously, you've got the big turbo, it's a yeah. GTS 4RS turbo. If you can see my t shirt here, they, they, they sent me some cool merch Love and that. stuff as well. Love that. You've got the front man intake as well that was sponsored by. By Chris as well, which is really, yeah. really cool. Going inside, the only thing you'll probably only see is the boost controller. Okay. A, a lot of people are going to end up cussing out my Audi uh, cut, but yeah. Yeah, what the hell is that about? <laughs> <laughs> but other than Fair that, enough. that's really it, really. I mean, there's not much to kind of look at. Obviously, you've got the diffuser yeah, uh, with the F1 this. light on there. Please do bear the car's a little bit dirty. I still need to put that wire in as well. So. <laughs> I wasn't prepared for today, oh, but yeah, there. other than that. Stock brakes, stock that, yeah, yeah, so yeah, complete Stock wheels, stock brakes, the whole stock lot. Diff. I mean, to be fair, yeah, open diff. So to yeah. be fair, the brakes are not that bad. They're I actually not it, that bad. Yeah, if you're not, if it's going to be like a, not like, you know, every corner slamming on the brakes. Like yeah, exactly. And plus, remember, this is my daily. Is it? This is my daily car. Love that. So in terms of like figures, I know people are going to wonder what figures. I mean, on, yeah, so you, yeah, on the boost figures. controller, you've got SP1, SP2, and SP3. So SP1 is low boost. Okay. I can't really give rough figures, probably 520, 530. Yeah. SP2. Uh, I'm definitely convinced, maybe just around about touching 600 horsepower. Okay. Yeah. Uh, our SP3 is E30. Yeah. Uh, we yeah. haven't, obviously, I'm going to be dining it on E30 eventually. I'm yeah. not sure when. 
probably after my honeymoon, but yeah. <laughs> so hopefully once that's Some, done. Somewhat priority. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, my wife was like, you get the kit, but you're not prioritizing yeah. that after that. Yeah, yeah. So, so E30, probably what, 650, 700? I'm convinced it's, I mean, remember, it is on a TU pump. So I'm ah, probably true. E30, probably around 650. Okay. I'm, yeah. I'm convinced maybe 650, 660. So in the current mode, you're in high boost uh, pump fuel. About yeah, 600 yeah, yeah, yeah. On a day, it's my daily, isn't it? So I'm not going to chuck E30. I mean, yeah, I, I would love to. Too much power. I would love to. Just but... 600, that'd yeah, be fine. Yeah. Mate, I, I need to have a look at this turbo stats up again. So this, what I hate about mine is obviously, I've still got the stock placement for the intake. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. You can't see my Pro 800. No, 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 no you can't. That is a big old turbo. Isn't it? Yeah, the, the turbo is like, so big we compared turbo. it. So we compared the GTS 4S turbo with the yeah. stock one. <laughs> it's a big difference. It's like yeah. bigger than my head. I'm like, whoa. <laughs> Love it. And this is obviously a kit. Well, it's called the OP1000 yeah, because yeah, it's yeah. capable of that 1000 horsepower. Yeah, a lot of people are saying my videos like, oh, you're not running 1000. I'm like, dude, it's 1000 yeah. horsepower ready. Yeah, it's not yeah. running 1000. <laughs> So but you're it's, gonna have to forge the engine and everything like that. Yeah, I mean, like, like I said, I was telling Ricky when I got featured on his channel, yeah. like the plan is, even on my channel, the plan is to hit 10K subs. Okay. And then I'll start the build in terms of like forging it and stuff. But yeah. even during the time, I might not even do that. I might probably do it before 10K. Yeah. But it all kind of depends Straight on my Straight off life. of the honeymoon, mate. Yeah, 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 don't worry. But LSD is next. <laughs> yeah. There's oh, no, there's nothing yeah, to yeah, it. Yeah. LSD is a must. Absolutely. I mean, I'm running 100 to 200. Yeah. With two passengers in there, 6.2. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's yeah, decent. Which, yeah, that's like decent. I said, which is why I upset... On pump fuel as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, no, sorry, it was E30, I think. Oh, that was an E30. E30. Yeah, I think it was E30. Yeah, because Chris okay. and his colleague did it. Oh, okay. I wasn't, gotcha. I wasn't there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, so, Sweet. yeah, 6.2, which is not that bad. No, not at all. For what it is, not it's pretty, pretty yeah. impressive, especially on an open diff. Yeah. Yeah, is which is really true. impressive. That's very true. Anyway, mate, I think that's pretty much everything for now. Yeah, we'll go for a drive and hopefully... Definitely. We'll, we'll go out and uh, experience this. Perfect. Open diff loveliness. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable! It's insane. Oh yeah, my it's, days! Yeah, it's serious. This is a, it's a serious piece of kit. It really, really is. That is mental. But if you see it off the line, watch. That. Yeah, watch off the line. Yeah. Listen to the. You can hear the scream quite properly, right? Yeah. So. <laughs> Mate, that is incredible. I know, I know. And remember, that's half throttle. That's that was not full, half throttle. Yeah, that's not full. I don't like doing through because the problem is full throttle. It just constantly spins. That's yeah. all it does. Yeah. But there's Jesus. overruns. Chuck it, mate. <laughs> Chuck it. Comfort. <laughs> I remember your S3 was. Yeah, so that was. Bad. Yeah, that was like. Yeah, that was really, really bad actually. You notice how, like, you know, with your one, yeah, it's a gradual. Yeah. This yeah. is not. This minute it's hits around 3k. Bad. It's just an explosion of power. Wow. Well, there you go. <laughs> it's insane, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Wow. I think one thing, I'll tell you something. One thing I've learned is that, you know what, It's sometimes it's not all about power. Yeah. It might have, okay, it's around 600, but it's all about, is it actually putting the 600 down? Mm. I might have an open diff, but you can see. It's not bad. It puts the power down, doesn't it? It's not, yeah, it's, oh, that spool. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's, it's but then but this is my daily. So now we're in eco, right? Oh, no, wait. So driving normal, oh. it's quite quiet. There's not much. And the, the, the best part of it is all you get to hear is that turbo whistle. That's yeah. all you hear. You don't yeah. hear anything else. But, oh, absolutely. Yeah. Mental. Remember, it's my daily, so I like I don't like to rag it. Respect for daily. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Respect for daily. I mean, I travel what, twenty five minutes to work. Yeah. But then, like, sometimes I get to have that kind of fun. When are you getting the diff? Uh, everyone keeps saying I'm putting Chucky Eco, but is what it is. Um, when I'm getting a diff, I don't. I'll be honest, with you, I don't know. I kind of decided that I want to run this setup for at least a couple of months, and the reason being mm -hmm. is because I want to test it. I want to okay. see how far I can get with this kit because remember we ran 100 200 6.2 mm. imagine what it will do a quarter mile yeah true i'm reckoning the high tens 
I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Maybe no tens. I'm not, I'm not really like that knowledgeable on decent times. Neither was I until I met Chris at Offspring. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's been educating me so much, but so over on your channel, you've basically documented the whole kit. Yeah, yeah. Been done I've well done it. Spray, right? I mean, I was supposed to, but then there was a couple of snags we had to had to sort out. Yeah. When I was supposed to collect the car, we couldn't get it mapped, so it was only running on a base map, and mm -hmm. that's why I didn't film all of it. I've probably filmed about 85% of it. Okay. So check that all on my channel. It's all there for you guys to watch. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So and you've got what? Three maps? No, it's just oh yeah, oh uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, so here, yeah, and, boost, yeah. So it's tuned it by HLC Performance. Okay. Uh, he's from Palestine, so he does all yeah. that. He's he's really really good. Yeah. He was, honestly, this guy's tuned some serious serious cars. And um, at first, I was a bit like, I'll be honest, I was a little bit hesitant. But then seeing the stuff he's done and the numbers we're smashing, yeah, it's insane. Yeah. Considering, listen, at six point two, yeah, hundred two hundred on a on. I'm not. I've got no suspend, no suspension mods. <laughs> You're no a brave LSD. Man. I'm on an op open diff. So it's it's come on. If you go, if we're doing that number, imagine with the LSD. Yeah. And I'm, I'll be running ninety nine. So it's pretty impressive. Mm. But the whistle is just oh. Yeah. It's and it insane. looks completely stock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not. Yeah, this car is. is I rate that. To be fair, <laughs> I, I do rate that. But yeah, it's like, like the polar opposite of my car. <laughs> Literally the polar opposite. How does it feel then compared to your 730 to this? This power-wise, I haven't. I've only experienced my car once from the passenger seat. Okay. But sound-wise. Oh yeah, yeah, nuts. yeah, yeah. Doesn't sound Absolutely like a BCF, yeah, does it? It sounds like a muscle car. <laughs> It's yeah, like yeah. a V8. Because remember, sound really remember the sound is coming like straight from the manifold. Yeah, it's not going through any sort of down part. Yeah, none of this yeah. straight from the manifold. So it's yeah, it's, it's a serious. Proper. But as Power a day, wise, it's so linear though. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. so linear. Yeah, if you look at the graph, if you look at the boost and everything, the timing. It's, it's the TU pump still had more. Because mm. to be honest, I've only had rage fuel in my car running the full 730 twice. Yeah. I normally run it in the 620 pump map. Yeah. So yeah. there's only about 20 horsepower in it. If this yeah. is about 600. All right, so, I mean, I want, I want to get a dyno. I really yeah, do. Because yeah. I'm not really much of a dyno person. I'm not really that bothered. But when you actually drive it and get the feel of it, mm. you, you kind of get an idea of what it's actually pushing out. But yeah, it's, one thing I love about it, the fact that much to say you get LSD, but you'd be it actually genuinely puts the power down so well, mm, so it, it, so well. That's the re that's one of the main reasons why I was like I'm going to run this setup for a while. Jesus. It's not that bad. It's pr it's very I can handle it. It's quite easy to handle. Yeah. A lot of people say it's but it, it will is bite you, very. Though. Yeah. Oh no. It yeah. Yeah. But you know the difference is. A lot of people say, oh, you know how you don't expect it with these. This one, I kind of, I know when it's going to slide out. I just yeah, know straight yeah, away. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that spool is so <laughs> yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. It spools, I mean, it, it hits boost just, I think, tiny bit under three. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So, so it's not, not that bad, bad yeah. for what it is. For a big turbo. Yeah, yeah, it yeah is. the turbo is not hybrid. Yeah, it's a yeah, big turbo. Yeah, yeah, it's not. You know how it's like you usually get this tw twin scroll. Yeah. It's not. It's just one big solid. Yeah, 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 <laughs> it's yeah, like, yeah. But the but the whistle is oh, it's awesome. Mate, thank you for. Uh, no, it's for all right. No, 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 that's all right. <laughs> Epic fun. <laughs> now you guys can find Sean's links down below to his Instagram and YouTube channel if you guys want to learn more about the car and the progress of the build. But for me today, that is it. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, please do make sure you leave a like and make sure to subscribe for all the adventures still to come.